let us go back to the roots of the gospel. It's the holy life. <laughs> the holy life. It's compulsory. It is the mass. It is the mass for you to live according to his will. Because the holy life makes you to become different from other people. To speak in tongues. To worship God. That's what the Bible says. There are people who are worshiping idol. Because that word worshiping doesn't make you to qualify to enter the kingdom of God. The only thing that makes you to qualify is to live the holy life. God is holy. Who called us is holy. Who called us is holy. So what we need to do. We need to be holy like him. But you cannot be holy like him. Unless. You have Jesus. Because Jesus. Is the way. And the life. And the truth. is the one. Who will make you. Holy. In another way, it is compulsory. He is telling you there is a difference when a person asks you, if a person asks you something, that person is not expecting you to say yes. Is expecting to answer yes or no. Because he's is asking you. But here, God doesn't ask you. He's telling you. Good as I call you. As I am holy. So you need also to be holy. Because there's no way for me to call you. As I am holy. But if I call you, you think you can serve me. You think you can come and enjoy the life with me. As I am holy, if you're not holy, it's not possible. You need to be holy. The first thing that God does is to convert us from our weakness. Because you cannot become holy with your own strength. You will fail. But the Spirit of God, let me say this. Thing. It's very important. It's very important as a Christian to build good relationship with the Holy Spirit. Not to build the good relationship with your colleagues but to go the good relationship with the spirit of God because the advantage of building the good relationship with the spirit of God the spirit of God is always with you even if we are in your corner the spirit of God is with you if you build a good relationship with me but the the problem about me is only that when we are in your closet, I am not there. It is very important to have the good relationship with the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit will guide you, will keep you, will monitor you even in your closet where I cannot able to see you. It is very important, my God, to Build a good relationship with the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit stands for Jesus. You cannot become good in Jesus if you are not good in the Holy Spirit. You need the Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit is there for Jesus. The Holy Spirit stands for Jesus. Even when you pray, pray according to the Holy Spirit. Even when, you, even when you walk, walk according to the Holy Spirit. Even when you talk, talk according to the Holy Spirit. Make a good relationship.
relationship with the Holy Spirit. Because if you are in a good relationship, you are allowed the Holy Spirit to become your friend to tell you even a single thing that is happening in your life. The Holy Spirit will guide you, will tell you, hey, look here, my friend. Don't use this way. Don't use this way. If you use this way, there are lions that are on your way. If you are a good relationship with the Spirit of God, the Spirit of God will tell you, listen here, my friend. Don't talk like this. Because if you talk like this, these people who are around you, they cannot say God because you are here. You are representing God. Let me tell you something. Church of God is not about tongues. It's not about coming to church every day. It's about good relationship with the Holy Spirit. I am asking you today, it's not about big church. It's not about big names. But it's about the good relationship with God. It doesn't matter. You are in the small church. It doesn't matter. You are in the small town. It doesn't matter. You are, you are, you are in the small house. It doesn't matter. You are driving a small car. It's not about car. It's not about church. It's about a relationship with the Holy Spirit. I might be not good and in you. I might be not right in your eyes. But in the Holy Spirit, I am good because I've got the good relationship with the Spirit of God. Church of God, stop doing what you are doing. Go build the good relationship with the Spirit of God. The Spirit of God is here, is with us, is close to you, as far as in you, but you must build.